What's up, guys? Time for another five-minute game. I really need to beat somebody good. This is going to be the game. This is the one I do it. What's that? What flag is that? I'm going to figure it out. Is it Norway? What is this move? Is this a move that people play? I've never seen it before. I feel like maybe I can even take on F7 for some sicko reason. Whatever. I'm just going to... Wait, can I take on E5? I don't know what's happening. I'm just going to castle, not waste all my time in this crap. C3, I guess. This is annoying. He got the two bishops. Obviously, there was some way I could have taken advantage of this. I just didn't know what it was, and now he has two bishops. And I'm just going to play chess position with him having two bishops and me not having it. <coughs> um, <coughs> so I'm just developing my knight to, to g3. Typical square. I mean, honestly, this position should already be f fine for black, just because the two bishops mean something. So I just kind of didn't play it right. I'll just develop my pieces. Position sucks. Maybe bishop g5 now? <laughs> Why does he make every move instantly? It's a jerk. I don't know, I, I feel like I can't... I could take it and then have two knights against two bishops, but it's like, that's not good, right? But if I go back... I'll go back, like a... You know, I'll admit my mistake. He could go c5 now, though. That kind of sucks for me. God, I suck so bad at chess. It's like... Huge disgrace. <clears throat> so, I mean, black is doing totally, totally good here. Uh, I want to go bishop c1, I think. And just at least hold on to my one bishop. I'm threatening e5, so he's going to go bishop to g7. Now i got to figure out how to make anything happen here. h4 is interesting, but it also creates a weakness for me. Like h4, I think queen f6, and if h5, g5. Ah, this position sucks. Maybe knight f1 to e3? I don't know. That doesn't look so good either, though. Holy crap. Why do I every game get such a bad position? Alright, let's look at d4. If he goes e4, knight e5, bishop takes, pawn takes. I'm attacking the h pawn, but somehow it looks, looks very sketchy to me. But I might do it, I might do it. No, it can't be good. Rook e2 looks horrible. That looks bad. Whatever, I'll do something. H4. I'm doing this, I'm live streaming this game. Somebody just told me to watch my time. Yes, I definitely should be watching my time because I'm down a minute and a half. Um, you know, whatever. <laughs> it sucks for me. Um, I guess, can I take on E5 or no? He has some kind of... I'm just going to take this. What the hell am I doing? I, I thought my... I just got really confused here. I thought he was attacking my F3 knight. He's actually attacking my G3 knight. Which means that when I... God, I suck. I'm like literally like the worst person on the internet at chess. Alright. I'm going to figure something out to make the game at least interesting. I guess I'm not. I guess I'm not. It's not going to be interesting. My position just sucks. Whatever. <clears throat> He's going to take my bishop and take on h4. Alright, now do I have any... The thing is... Alright, I'm going to go queen e2. At least I have some queen activity. Is queen e7 any good? Probably not. <coughs> I'll go here. I have no idea what to do. Once he gets his rook into the game, I'm probably pretty screwed. I have some ideas of like queen... Okay, what does that do? He wants to take on 
f3, so I'll stop him from doing that. Queen h3 seemed a little weird, but okay, I have no time left and my position's horrible, so... Probably... <laughs> I'm not too happy here. Now at least I have an idea of rookie 7 which doesn't really do that much, but... Something. Um, I'm attacking the f-pawn now. He's playing like garbage, but it's not gonna matter, I don't think. Alright, I gotta focus, because I actually have a chance now. He's playing a lot of bad moves. I have an active rook. His queen is m totally misplaced. So let's see if I can make something happen. I think g5 makes sense. But then I go rook e7, rook g8. Alright, I'm gonna just play this move. I guess I'll take this. Alright, buddy, d4. Um, now what? How do I proceed? That looks re reasonable, but I realize rook e8 is very scary. It might just crush me. Shit. Why do I have to suck at chess? Uh... I don't know what to do, guys. I think I just blew it. King f1, queen h4... Oh boy, I give up. <coughs> Excuse me. I think this move... It's funny, queen g5 might, might lose to knight g4. That's crazy. But I actually don't see a defense. That's insane if that if that's real. Wow. That's insane. I hope he does it. Knight g4. What a crazy ass move. Wow. Do it, man. What a move. Now I'm threatening queen g7. His only move is rook e7. And I'm just, I'm just winning. It's insane. I am awesome at chess. It is official. That that's just crazy, man. Cause like, I totally. How could you know his rook and his queen are just like attacking my king, and now it's just like he has nothing. He's just suddenly I'm checkmating him. This is his only chance, but it's not going to work. Just, he just resigns because I'm going to queen my d-pawn. Unbelievable game. Wow. How the hell did that happen? <coughs> um, that's crazy. i got to go back for that and, and check something out here. I mean, of course I played the opening like a total jerk. So what am I supposed to do here? Like, why don't people play this way? I'm going to look it up on chess base. <coughs> Whoops. One second. Just checking out, looking up the opening. It'll take me a second to, to look it up. Oh. Because he played some... It's this knight a5, like, right away thing. I've just never seen it. Nobody plays it. There was one game that went castles, d6, and then white went d4. But it thinks, see, it thinks I should just go fast with d4, maybe because he's not developing his pieces. Instead, c3, it thinks black is already doing fine. So c3 was a bad choice. Um, wow. But the end of this game was crazy, because I totally blundered, I thought. <coughs> I mean, he started to mess up here. My queen started like, causing havoc in his position. 
Houdini still says it's good for black, but now it's starting to light white. And the rookie eight, I thought I was losing for sure. When this rook comes in, that's funny though. Houdini thinks I'm still doing good after queen c7. And I just noticed this knight g4 move after um, after he checked me. I realized queen g5 looked like it was losing. Yeah, knight g4 game over, it says. That's a cool little move. He recommends rook c1. I would have probably went, I don't know, if c4 he takes on d4, if d5 he takes on c3. So, would have been a tough game, but he, it's easy to miss a move like knight g4. And, yay, I got a win. Um, thanks, everyone, for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.